the first talk uh, this morning was about uh, the reason that uh, why we have all come together, Christian groups and evangelical groups and the, the Catholics, uh, the problems in our country, economics, political, and uh, the second focused on the instrument that we have, the, the Gabay Cristo, and the uh, going through the 20 questions that are there. Uh, this afternoon, I'd like to uh, begin this uh, part by uh, sharing, well, a few scripture verses, if you don't mind, uh, beginning with Exodus chapter 18, verse 21. Look for able men from all the people men who fear God, who are trustworthy and hate a bribe. Uh, medyo, pati pala, si, pati pala sa Israelites, may mga nagbabribe na pala ng opisyalis nun. So it's nothing new. Matagal na yung uh, problema na yan. And that's uh, command of the Lord. And on uh, for our part, we'd like to start this from the people to select these uh, men and women. And that's the whole concept of the primary, meaning the candidates will come from the uh, local organizations or the local chapters uh, of the PMTL. So, if you look at the PMTL, the group is made up of faith-based organizations and uh, it will function with the same uh, prayer, with the same instrument, and with the same goals of transforming the leadership uh, of the country through these uh, tools. Now, Deuteronomy chapter 1, verse 13 reads, uh, Choose wise, understanding, experienced, and respected men, and I will make them heads over you. And finally, 1 Peter chapter 2, verses 9 and 10, which is familiar to many of us. You are a chosen generation. Chosen, uh, selected. No? Hindi lang naman Israelites, marami naman sila. Eh. But they are chosen. A royal priesthood, a holy nation, his own special people. So they're set apart. Yung kanilang pagiging hudyo is very special as a matter of fact, Jesus became a Jew later on in history. Who, were, who once were not a people but are now the people of God. So meron silang pinagdaanan sa buhay. No? Meron silang uh, struggles as a people. And uh, the, I'd like to uh, share, keeping that in mind, this is very pe peculiar only for us. Mga taga dito sa ating bayan. Uh, ang ibig sabihin ng chosen or selected sa lingwahe natin ay pili. Diba? Alam mo yung pili natin. <laughs> pili. Pili means uh, selection at uh, mamimili tayo. No? Pili means chosen and selected. Next, lipi means race, tribe, or lineage. Uh, the, uh, like what we read kanina in uh, First uh, Peter. And pino means refined, smoothened. May pinagdaanan sa buhay. Uh, so pag pinagsama-sama nyo lahat yan, eh yan ang Pilipino. Amen? And if you go back to the earlier slide, yung First Peter Two, chapter 9 to 10 that's talking about the Israelites but it might as well be talking about us our country Amen so it's uh, wonderful and exciting every time you look at the spiritual uh, perspective insofar as the organization is concerned the Filipino movement for transformational leadership uh and uh, how we can uh, move. Kumbaga, after today, what's next? Yun ang mga tanong. There are two websites. One is gabaycristo.ph 
the other one is gabaycristo.com. Bakit dalawa pa? Eh, yan ang purpose ng dalawa. Yung .ph is a public website. Nandyan ang uh, wise of uh, paano nag-umpisa, what it's all about, sino mga conveners, ganyan, ng uh, PMTL. So, uh, lahat ng five languages ng Gabay Kristo available dyan for download. Uh, that's the public website. The other one, gabaykristo.com, is what is uh, more of my interest now. Ah, but uh, sige, go to the next slide. That's the gabaykristo.ph. That's our public website. That's our public website. At uh, makita naman sa selections dyan. Uy, meron. Ayan o. Who we are, what we do, how you can help, news, contact us. And then if you go, if you scroll down, that's the next slide. Yan ang nasa ilalim. Get Gabay Cristo in the five languages. Take online polls. Uh, that has to do with the primary. Volunteer for those who want to participate in the primaries. Nandyan yung shortlist na pinag-usapan kanina na dalawang uh, vice president at labin limang senador. Nandyan. And then watch videos. Uh, various videos, interviews on radio, on TV, or uh, direct uh, face-to-face interviews with various uh, conveners, those involved. So, nakakailang talk shows na rin. Uh, si Attorney Alex, Roy, Bishop Ruben Abante, na-interview na sila kung saan-saan no? on TV. And uh, those uh, videos are here, available here. Uh, Okay. So that's gabaykristo.ph. Now, my interest with you is gabaykristo.com. That is a uh, for members only website. As a matter of fact, homepage pa lang, may hinihingi na na email at saka password. Hindi ka makakapasok kung wala ka nung, <laughs> nung password. But, at the site, nil- nilabas muna namin kasi maraming kailangan-kailangan na ng ating voters education kit yung mga kinopya sa flash drive ninyo nandito rin naman pwede nyo ring i-download nandito rin ayan no sa kanan the primer the CBCP pastoral letters you have uh, Gabay Cristo English Tagalog kasalukuyan habang nagsasalita ako tinatrabaho ni Michael yun ang programmer natin nilalagay na niya yung tatlo pang versions yung lang languages dyan uh, yung uh, local chapter membership form and uh, others. Pati yung ano, isasama dyan, yung uh, song. May bagong labas. Mainit-init pa kasi mamayang gabi ko pa ibibigay kasi lumapit na ang Veritas. And they're asking for 30 seconds and 1 minute radio spots. So, meron na. Yung ini-air dito kanina, tayo pa lang anak yung uh, hatid sa inyo ng, ano, at ng himpilang ito. So, mamayang gabi, ibibigay ko na yon sa Veritas at uh, baka next week marinig na natin yan tuloy-tuloy hanggang eleksyon. So, kasama yan ng kanilang station IT. But apart from that, lahat ngayon actually nag-air na ng commercials ang FABC at ang mga uh, radio stations ang at ng uh, Christian uh, brothers and sisters natin. So, umaandar na yan sila. And then, this uh, Gabay Cristo, that one, that's actually a link pag, uh, ay, hindi pala itong gusto ko. Pag clinic nila, pupunta yan sa .ph. So, that's uh, what that's for. Now, pag uh, meron ka ng uh, uh, username and password at pumasok ka, depende kung sino ka, <laughs> doon ka sa page na yun pupunta at dadalhin ng system. Now, Uh, in terms of the organization, there are national organizations. Examples are uh, FTCC, so, ELIM, FTCC-ELIM. Because ELIM is not a convener, but we're part of FTCC. FTCC-Booklod ng Pag-ibig, dash Spirit of Love. Yan. Uh, United Methodist Church, uh, Jesus is Lord, Philippines for Jesus Movement. Yan, mga national organization. So, kayo sa Two Hearts, Ryan, under ano pa rin yun? FTCC-Two Hearts. Okay? So, ang nagdadala sa inyo ay FTCC. So, aangat yun sa national. 
the regional level uh, is uh, really the geographic region. Region 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, uh, NCR, Cordillera, ARM, ganyan. No? And then uh, local chapters will be the actual communities that you represent. So halimbawa, uh, uh, na ako dun. Tagig. No, halimbawa, Ilim Tagig. So you can create a local chapter. It will be a, uh, a PMTL Ilim Tagig chapter. Okay? Uh, it will be a PMTL uh, United Methodist Church Tagig chapter. So marami kayo dyan in one area. So, for example, Ilim alone, we will have 170 chapters spread out through Luso, the, the regions, the regions that are there. No? Uh, the next slide ayan, will show, uh, it's just a sample no? uh, of the, the, the how many national organizations there are, how many regional organizations, and local chapters there are. So, for the regions na yan, na makukover. So, next slide. So, yan na yan. Now, where will the dioceses fall under uh, the diocese will be a regional uh, group. No? So, the diocese, anong region ba ang CDO? 10. So, it will be a regional group sa region 10. And, uh, Last time, ang mga nag-attend ay ang uh, Diocese of Novaliches at saka Diocese of uh, Katarman. Tama? Katarman. No, so, uh, and I think Antipolo also is coming. So, kanya-kanyang region yan. And then the parishes will be considered as the local chapters. Now, what will be needed there are lay coordinators for each uh, mahirap siguro kung isa lang baka dalawa para palitan sila no? or may substitute pag hindi makakarating yung isa so the same goes for you if uh, please uh, get your uh, voters education kit inside is the uh, this one local chapter membership form local chapter membership form so for those of you who represent uh, local chapters, then you can fill this up. If you are a national organization, just erase local and put their national, no? but use the same form anyway. Now, there's a peculiarity in the system uh, online uh, to address our... Uh, Brother uh, Pastor's uh, concern of security, which is a real concern, actually voiced out by many of the uh, conveners. No, alam mo naman sa mga politika, eh, uso yung mga uh, infiltrate, infiltrate. So how do we do it? So for example, I'll just give the uh, case of Elim, no? Kasi doon ako familiar talaga. For example, nagawa na yung uh, FTCC dash Ilim community. Now, uh, we do not have regional uh, organizations kasi direction na tayo kagad sa branch or startup. But we do have regional coordinators. So, ang regional coordinator for Luzon, ako, si uh, Brother Roger sa Mindanao, at si Tata si sa uh, Visayas. Okay? And then sa local chapters, uh, will be uh, hindi pa nakikreate yan so you will create that actually we have a choice I can do it so the regional or the national head can create a lower level or a local chapter or your local chapter itself you can create it now once you create it it is subject to confirmation by uh, a higher up no? confirmation meaning oh, just one click ay kilala ko to pa Hindi rin naman niya magagawa kung hindi siya nakalag-in, di ba? So, uh, that means that your members, for example, si Atenel for Commonwealth, hindi sila makakapasok as a member 
because your chapter does not exist. Meaning, you have to create first the MTL, uh, Ilim Kaloocan chapter. Once that's there already, pwede na sila mag-member. Ngayon, pag nag-member sila, pending yon. Parang sa Facebook, di ba? Invite a friend. Pero kailangan i-confirm mo. Eh kung ayaw ko, di ba? Kung hindi ko siya friend, di ba? So ito, uh, merong memberships na darating online and the chapter head, the branch head, will have to confirm them one by one. So that's how to guarantee na ay talagang member ng simbahan yan. No? Hindi kung sino-sino lang yan. So as it is, kahit napakalaki niyang organization na yan, everybody knows everybody. So that's the that's the kind of uh, protection that we're trying to get into the uh, system. No? So uh, once this gets filled up, ang nakalagay dito ay uh, organization. So tayo ay fpcc elim uh, group head, elder, pastoral leader, that's uh, Brother Willie Nakar. Uh, now, the address and the area, hindi na dito kung saan na kayo. Doon na yung address and area. Okay? Uh, group information has to do with your specific... Ah, I know, I know, I know. Sorry. Uh, let me correct myself. Kasi nagawa, nagawa na yung national na papel. So, tapos na. Huwag nyo nang gagawin. Ang gagawin nyo for your local chapter, your local branch. So, uh, ilim, kaloocan, ganon. Okay? And then, the group head will be Nelia Kosho. Okay, now, you, there are some groups kasi that have a different Gabay Cristo coordinator who is not their head. Huh? So, kaya meron ditong coordinator 1 and coordinator 2. If you want to put yourself there, okay then. No problem. If you want to put another person, okay then. No? Now, of course, we do not expect that everybody pupunta online. Di ba? Marami tayong lugar. Lalo na sa probinsya, wala namang computer dun. Eh, no? So, it is the chapter head's uh, responsibility na sila ay ma-encode. So, meaning, uh, you can just have the members uh, use the Gabay Cristo form. Ito. Yung Gabay Cristo natin. Yan ang dahilan kung bakit sa likod, nando ng application ng member. Okay? Individuals ito. So, pag-fill up nyo lang sila dyan, kukolektahin niyo, and then, yung head, kayo na mag-encode niyan kayo na rin na mag-approve. Di ba? So, one, one uh, swing lang. Halimbawa, sa tondo, wala namang computer sila lahat doon. Di ba? So, ay meron, high-tech na ngayon. Ha? Sorry, mali pala ako. Dapat pala ang example ko sa mga fishermen. <laughs> Pero kahit sa bundok, ano meron na ngayon? Anyway. Anyway, dito. So, ito yung mga members na, and then, kayo rin na mag-approve. So, what are the specific things that uh, we need to do? Number one, organize and register your faith-based organizations. Now, we understand that the movement came before uh, my appointment as membership <laughs> uh, or before the creation or thinking of any membership organization. And uh, marami nang gumagawa nito. So, that's fine. And that's really the nature of uh, a movement. Uh, what this is doing is trying to uh, consolidate and uh, yun nga, register so that we know who to coordinate with in various regions and areas. Number two, share the Gabay Cristo with your group. As uh, I said kanina, yung pinag-usapan natin, kanya-kanya na po tayong uh, kopya nito. Pwede nyo i-print out, i-photocopy, ganyan, with respect to our group. And then, when you conduct a voters' education seminar in your area, just inform us uh, on this date, uh, meron kaming uh, voters' education seminar, ganitong pecha, itong lugar namin, at uh, itong nag-attend. 
FYI lang. You don't need our approval. Okay? Go ahead. Now, uh, and then, very important, whenever you uh, meet with your group, pray the prayer for the nation and for elections. Yung prayer for elections, hanggang Mayo lang. Pag natapos ang eleksyon, wag nyo na ipagdasal yun. Ituloy nyo na yung ipagdadasal, yung prayer for the nation. Sa susunod na eleksyon, ipagdasal ulit natin yung prayer for the election. So, therefore, this movement is beyond just these uh, elections. It is really vision, uh, visioneering towards a transformed leadership for the country. How long or how short it will take, our prayer is that it happens sooner than later. Of course, only the Lord knows. But uh, as for us, whatever we can do now at this particular time, then we can move forward and do it. Amen.